everyone and welcome back to my channel if you're new here then welcome please hit the subscribe button below if you want to see more magical videos today's video is going to be all about wands and i have got two new wands i have got another um professor mystery wand from the wizarding world um and i also have a fake fake wand that i brought recently and I'm loving this company, I have to say, that I'm getting these ones from, so I'm going to show you one of those. Before I start, however, um, I've got a new company that I would like to tell you about. It's nothing to do with Harry Potter, but I love this company and I want to shout them from the rooftops. So this is a company called Snag. Snag. I'll just show you here snag and they basically make predominantly tights <laughs> that's gonna sound really weird tights what is she talking about yes they're predominantly tights however they do like do like i think they do swimming costumes and some underwear stuff as well but it basically says that tights never fit they just never fit unless you stick thin they just don't fit and they're uncomfortable they tend to be the kind that you need to keep pulling up because they don't fit properly and this company basically you select your size based on their uh, special sizing thing and you choose which types you want and they come and mine came yesterday it came really quickly the tights are such good quality they feel luxurious and smooth and soft they come in a huge array of colors patterns i mean luna lovegood would be in her element let me tell you um and they come look how cute this is they come wrapped in these like little bags which again is so good for the environment as well i mean this one is my builder's tea ones um and they don't come with any useless packaging um that's what they look like pretty standard but they feel so soft and they come in lots of different deniers as well but they are brilliant and i i love them um i'm gonna go for some exciting types next time and go for like like funky ones um but they like i say they come in lots of different patterns um they do like winter tight summer tight all sorts of things um that is the card that came as well so snug so pretty cool um and there's all sorts of information on here but they're just they're just cool they're just cool and they fit and they're comfortable they're amazing anyway let's get on to the ones okay so the first one i'm going to show you is the one i actually bought off the internet now these are from ebay but there is a particular company and i'll put the link below who are brilliant the ones are they're fake they're never going to be as good as the originals let me just put that out now they're not um but for general kind of just display they're good enough um and if your kids want to play with ones and you don't want to spend a fortune on them, then again, pretty good for that too. But they come like literally the next day, like literally the next day. They're £11 or £11.99. I think the postage and packaging is free. I'm sure it is. But they're pretty good. Um, so it comes with the boxes, which are pretty accurate to the actual ones. Um, obviously it's different on the front it says magic wand and fantastic magic world nice little touch there the foiling is beautiful you even get the labels on the front which are pretty good so this is Tonks's wand these boxes also have the um whatever this stuff is the voil <laughs> um which is very fancy it comes with a card, um, so it comes with the card of the character, which is a cool little touch. 
we do have the velvet it's obviously not as good quality it is basically just styrofoam with this stuck on top so it's not as good but it's they've made the effort the wand itself let me just get it out the shape and the length and everything is really quite accurate have no beef with that i mean i think that is pretty damn close in shape to the original i mean there's a few little things a little you know it's a little bit lumpy there and stuff like that but and maybe it's not as quite as fine in the detail but when it's on a wall in the background who's gonna notice i'm not gonna notice i don't care and for the price of 11 pound i could buy so many more ones that i could with the the proper ones so i'm gonna save my money with the proper official ones for the ones that i really desperately want um now the one thing that does let these ones down slightly is the paintwork so if i do a close-up on this you can see that the paintwork is not great and depending on what ones you get depends on how obvious that is some of the ones it's not that obvious on other ones like this one probably more so it is pretty obvious that the paintwork is pretty shoddy. <laughs> um, but again, like I say, you're not really going to notice it from the shelf. So that is my Tonks wand that I got. And I will, like I say, I'll put the link below because I think if you're trying to go for a replica wand, um, but a cheap version, I think these ones are definitely the best I've found. So the moment of truth, we have a mystery wand. <sighs> now, if you've watched my videos before, you know that I have a love hate relationship with these ones. I love these ones. I think they're really exciting. The quality of them is brilliant. I love the stands that they come in. My big bugbear is the price. Given that you don't know what ones you're going to get. And I, re I know why they're doing it. I know that's the whole point of a mystery wand and I know why they're doing it. They're doing it because they want to make more money because they want you want to get the collection. So you're going to go out and keep buying them. And if you get a duplicate, you're just going to go out and buy another one. So I know why they're doing it. But I personally feel that as a fan of Harry Potter, I would be much more likely to go out and buy all of the ones if I knew what the one was. I would buy the whole collection, without a shadow of a doubt. And that's a lot of money. I mean, how many ones are there? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. That's just in the Professor series. So I would buy all of those nine ones. That is a lot of money. That's like a few hundred quid. So, yeah, I have to say, I, I whenever I go and buy one of these, £15 always seems like a lot of money to spend when I don't know what I'm getting. And that does bother me. I've only ever had one duplicate, which was my Professor Trelawney wand, which I used at the start. But it, I tried to sell it and it took me months to get my money back. And I had to reduce the price to £10 so I didn't get my full amount. Um, but it was better than nothing. So I'm hoping... That this is not going to be a duplicate because otherwise that i just that's why i always get scared with these um i was this is how sad i am <laughs> i went through the whole box in b and m of these ones pressing the box to see if i could feel what the one might be and looking for kind of telltale signs so i don't know whether i've got this right i don't know whose it is but i think i've hopefully avoided the ones that i've already got um just in case you don't know the ones i haven't got yet are professor flitwick remus lupin professor mcgonagall uh severus snape and uh pomona sprout so those are the ones i haven't got so i'm hoping i will get one of them let's have a look i hate this bit it should be exciting, but instead I get nervous. Oh god, if I can get it. Oh god, I can't get it out. I literally can't get this out. Ah, right, got it. Oh, we've torn the box, so I hope this isn't a duplicate. I can't tell from the tip. 
I have to say. Let's have a look. This doesn't look like one I've got. I uh, I've got Professor Lupin. Oh, I love Lupin. I love Professor Lupin. He is definitely one of my favourite characters. I think probably my my third favourite character after Sirius and Luna. Um, and I love his wand. It's just so... I don't know. It just suits him. It's so kind of woody and, oh, I don't know, tactile. And I love these kind of little knobbly bits on it. Um, and this lovely wooden handle. It's just lovely. It's lovely to hold. What a really lovely one. That's so nice in the palm of your hand like that. That's lovely. I mean, these ones, if you don't know already, sure you do, <laughs> are shorter than the originals. So the originals will be much longer. But they're not far off and they are proper replicas. I mean, they are really good quality. Um, so let's have a look at the stand now because this is one of the best bits. So we have, first of all, the stand that says Remus Lupin. And then what do we have? Oh, okay. That took me a while, actually. That took me a moment. Um, this is a wardrobe. <laughs> this is the wardrobe from uh, the Prisoner of Azkaban, where he is teaching the class about boggarts, and he lets the boggart out of the wardrobe every time the child steps forward. So that is Remus Lupin, and I'm going to put his wand in there now, like so. That's a thing of beauty. I love Lupin. Um, so yeah, so I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope it's been of some use, um, especially in terms of the, the fake wandry, if that's what you're into and you're after a good cheap replica. Um, but yeah, and the uh, snag shop of tights, if you're into tights, then please check them out or if you're dressing up as luna love good check them out they've got some brilliant tights on there so uh i will see you very very soon for another video and if you like this and you'd like to see more of this kind of thing hit the like button see you very soon bye